Hi everyone, welcome to today's episode of Cooking with Muna and Mish. Today we are going to make Baba Ghanouj or we call it Mtabbal. Everybody loved this recipe, kids and adults, and I hope you also like it too. And here is how I made it. Now for the ingredients, we have, uh, this is the roasted eggplants. So it came to about two and a half cups. And um, this is one cup of pomegranate seeds. And also we have about two tablespoons of pomegranate seed for garnish. And two to four tablespoons of uh, parsley, minced parsley. And that's for garnish. And one tablespoon of Himalayan salt. Uh, one quarter uh, cup of tahini sauce. And then we have, this is two tablespoon of uh, yogurt. Uh, this is plain yogurt make sure don't use vanilla plain yogurts and our measurements is all in standard you know um, cups and uh, spoons so this is the measurement of two spoons okay if you don't have pomegranate or it's not in season you can use pomegranate molasses instead of one cup of pomegranate seeds you can use one to two tablespoons of molasses and it depends on the sweetness of the pomegranates. You may need three to four tablespoons of lemon juice. And oh, I forgot to tell you about the garlic. So we use about five to six cloves of garlic. I put a little bit Himalayan salt on it and I smashed it. Make sure make it creamy. And here is how I prepared the eggplant. I bake them and before I bake them, I made slit on each side of them. And then we're gonna put it in the oven. And like this, I put it under the broiler. And here after I took them off the oven, so it took about 20 minutes. And uh, per in purpose, I let it burn a little bit because that's gonna give us, you know, the char. It's the uh, delicious uh, taste, okay? So I put it about 10 minutes on each side i flip it after 10 minutes okay now we're gonna peel it after i like to wait till it cool to peel it now just i'm gonna show you how i peel the eggplant i cut it in half okay you can keep it attached or detached and then just I scoop it out with a spoon Make sure you scoop all the flesh. Okay. And that's it. Uh, we finish it up. So whichever way you're comfortable, you can peel it by your hand. Some people, you know, they put it while it's hot uh, in a bowl and cover it so it will peel easily. Any way you like. Now this water that comes out from the eggplant, I just throw it away. I don't uh, use it, okay? So now what I do, I just uh, cut it a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna put it in a measuring cup for you uh, so you can see it's, uh, so you can see exactly how much to use, you know, because each eggplant, you know, weighs different. It came out to two and a half cups. First thing, we're gonna get the juice out of the pomegranate. So we'll put it in the food processor. And now we're going to drain it out of the seeds. So now I'm just going to measure it just in case if you have already juice. And it came out to about like one third of a cup. Now first thing we're going to add the eggplant. And the eggplant we chopped it a little bit. But um, you can put it in the food processor too and make it soft. Or the traditional way is we just smash it with this smooth but still have little chunks there okay so now we're just gonna add all other ingredients now we're gonna add the salt now we're gonna add the yogurt now we're gonna add the tahini sauce now we're gonna add the pomegranate juice or if you don't have pomegranate juice you can add uh, pomegranate molasses now we're gonna add the lemon juice we're not gonna add it all, we're just gonna taste it, okay? Now we're gonna add the garlic. Let's make sure that the garlic is creamy. You don't want it any chunks. Then we mix it really well. Okay. 
I tasted it and it needed more lemon. So in total, it took three tablespoons. And here is about two tablespoons of chopped parsley. I'm gonna mix it with it. Now we're just gonna plate it. And we spread it on the plate and we decorate it and we add the garnish. Here we added the parsley and then we add the pomegranate seeds. You can decorate it any way you like it. And now it's ready. And before serving, we add uh, olive oil, uh, about one to two tablespoons. And then you eat it with a pita bread, uh, tortilla chips, uh, veggie sticks. It was really, really yummy. Actually, the uh, pomegranate juice made a big difference in the taste. I hope you guys can try it. And if you try it, please let me know.